hello viewers to make the pattern on your screen we have mask the last so we're going to make the pattern so watch closely so you take a measurement half inch here and then you draw your center line so as you are drawing your center line you are going to mark where the toe gap stopped you can see it here that is where it stopped so let's start the pattern right from here so we take it down remember here is three inch measurement so we take it from there take it from there remember you can keep a picture of this pattern in front of you as you are drawing it so let's measure 0 0.6 from here the width of the strap so we'll take it again from there so this is where we're going to call this pattern from here so so now we are taking it to the uh toe gap we're taking it down to the toe gap so the pattern is um already drawn you can see that so let's cut it out it is very simple let's cut it out and then develop the pattern So you remove the pattern and then you paste it on your cardboard as always. Make sure it is straight and avoid too much creeps. So after pasting the pattern, you draw a straight line through the vamp and down to the toe gap area. So from here, the cone, you draw a straight line. Draw a straight line. After that, we're going to extend here. This is the uh, lasting allowance for the toe strap. So we're going to bring it down here. Bring it down. Yeah. So let's add a um, uh, folding allowance here, one inch. So I'm adding one inch here as the folding allowance, one inch. so um you extend this line too you extend the line so this is our one inch addition so you make sure the whole course are intact now we are going to fold this cardboard into two and then we cut out the pattern that is the first um part of the pattern the first part of it so we're going to cut it out now
so you can see how the first part looks like you can see what it looks like so um we are done with this once you get this the other ones are just minor so we're going to measure the length of the counter stripe say uh we're going to take the measurement so i'm going to be using around uh, 11 inch that is the length 11 inch and the width is going to be uh 0 0.6 inch so let me get a paper that is uh, long enough So remember the weight is going to be 0 0.6 inch and the length you can make it 12 inch but I'm going to measure 11 or 10 inch so that I don't run into short edge. So for you not to run into short edge you can make it uh, 12 inch or 11 inch. Remember the weight is 0 0.6 inch. It's 0 0.6 inch. So you leave a gap while cutting, uh, I forgot I'm going to do that, so uh, let me tape up this place I have just cut, let me tape it up. So you fold the cardboard into two equal parts to get the center of the line or the strap. So we're going to measure one inch from the top of the strap, one inch. And then we're going to measure on both sides of the center line, 0 0.3 inch each. 0 0.3 inch each on both sides of the center line and then we're going to extend them uh, this is where the buckle stripe will pass through at the back of the counter so the buckle strap this is where it, it is going to meet with this particular strap So you give it a curve at this point, you can see the curve, give it a curve. So you give it a curve on both sides here, you can see the curve, give it the curve to look good. So you can see that. So we're going to cut it out now. So this is the short strap that is going to go in into the insole um, meeting on the ring with the main pattern. So you can simply make this shape the same way you made the tongue on the strap. We just finished now. So you just use the same method in the stand. So you can see that, you see how it looks and then you cut it out I'm still going to add the length in this time to avoid shortage so we are done with the pattern you can see it so you can see that <coughs> 
um this is uh where the buckle strap went in you see the punch area then you cut the lines and then you fix your buckle strap you see that so the buckle is going to be around this area you understand so i'm pulling this one this way so the buckle is going to be here uh, around this area you see it so um thank you for watching this video so don't forget to subscribe to this channel and also hit the bell icon to get updates as soon as new videos drops thank you see you in our next video and have a nice day